Hey, what's going on, LP Army? Landon is still away, but I have some amazing stories for you. In the last video, I asked you guys, at what age do you want to get married? And this is what you said. In this video, I want to know where in the world do you want to travel to? Let me know. I read all the comments and look forward to seeing what you have to say. Now, I have my own personal channel, Most Amazing Top 5, and on there, I've posted videos about the top five off limit locations on planet Earth, as well as the top five ghost towns. Be sure to head on over to my channel and hit subscribe. That way, we can continue to hang out when I'm no longer here and Landon's back. Today on LP, we got a story about a 67 year old granny who was caught on camera disposing of a dismembered body. Yeah, and then she confessed to at least 10 other murders. My name is Michael McCredden and welcome to Landon Production. They're calling her the Granny Ripper, and she was caught just last week in St. Petersburg carrying around a torso in a plastic bag. The head, arms, and legs had been chopped off of a woman this granny at one time worked for. Once they searched this elderly woman's home, well inside they found evidence from the murder, there was a knife as well as blood, and they also started looking at her personal diaries. They detailed at least 10 murders in the past, dating back to the past two decades. Her husband, he's also thought to have been one of her former victims, why? Well, she reported him missing back in 2005. On top of that, there was also a tenant that was living in one of her flats. He was 44. He too, she confessed, yeah, killed him as well. Now the investigators are reading through all her diaries and they're stumbling upon so much information, they believe they're going to be able to solve a whole bunch of unsolved mysteries from the past. Yeah. Glad she's not my grandma. Moving on to other news, the British, they have developed a spaceship engine that is capable of getting people to the moon in just four hours. Landon right now, he's in Las Vegas, which is about a five hour flight from Toronto. The fact that this ship can leave Earth's orbit in less time? Yeah, that's like what? That's crazy. Is this real life right now? This machine uses solar power to produce its trust EM drive. Now if that sounds familiar to you, you must be a Star Trek fan because they had something called the impulse drive written into their scripts and it's kind of a similar theory. Now NASA, they have acknowledged the invention as being a possible practice in the future. So pack your bags ladies and gentlemen because your next fan meet up with Landon, well it could be in outer space. Now have you ever wondered what happens to your body when you indulge in a delicious can of Coca Cola? You should, because that stuff has the power to clean coins. A renegade pharmacist, he decided to take the time to document what exactly happens inside the human body when you enjoy a delicious drink of Coca Cola. In the first 10 minutes, you get that sugar rush we all know and love, but it's 100% the amount of sugar intake that any of us should be having. At 20 minutes, your blood sugar spikes, and the insulin, well, it starts converting that sugar into fat. At 40 minutes, your pupils, they dilate and you will be anything but drowsy. At 45 minutes, your body is loving the natural high and the extra energy. This is kind of similar to someone taking heroin. Not as extreme, but a similar high. And at 60 minutes and beyond, well your body, it needs to pee. Because there's zinc, calcium and magnesium that it just wants to get rid of. Next up, we have some Justin Bieber news. He sat down with Ryan Seacrest to discuss his next single, which is dropping on August 28th, 2015. It will be tight titled What Do You Me? Now his last song it was titled Where Are You Now? Going to show you that this guy is asking a whole lot of questions. He must be doing some soul searching. He also revealed to Ryan that he sometimes gets depressed. He's been putting in long days working on this album and wants it to be perfect. He's excited about this new single he's about to drop. He worked on it with an artist known as Pooh Bear. Justin Bieber also teamed up with Ryan Seacrest in a new television series known as Knock Knock, where they show up at the homes of Americans who are going through hard times. Justin delighted the family. He also gave them $10,000 for medical bills and a shopping spree on the house. Huh. <laughs> Shopping spree. I wouldn't mind one of those. In other news, Kendall Jenner, well, she took to Instagram to post this photo of her hanging out with Kylie's dog. Now, in our last video, we talked about the rumors surrounding Kylie getting engaged. So I can only imagine Kendall, she wanted a little bit of press attention for herself. But if you look at this photo, the poor dog, all he wants is to get out of the photo and to get out of that costume. All right, guys, I'm going to wrap it up here, but I do want to hear from you. Where do you plan on going on your dream vacation? Sound off in the comments down below. And there we go. Okay, guys, thanks so much for watching. Be sure to check out the most amazing top five, where I break down the world into brilliant top five lists. It's an amazing channel. I want you to head on over there and hit subscribe. Use the hashtag LP sent me, and I'm going to wait till you do it. Have you gone? You, oh, you went? Oh, okay, cool, guys. See you in the next one.